today at Westport Auto Center. We're very proud to present this very special 1956 Continental Mark II, celebrity owned, the famous country western singer Roy Clark. Most people know him from Hee Haw. Owned this car since 1980, still on the 1980 title, still in his name on the front of the title. Uh, just a super, super neat car, very rare, uh, besides being uh, famously owned by a famous person. This car was right at $10,000 new. Only upgrade or option you could get was the air conditioner, which puts you at a price point of $10,400. In $95 in 1956, which was probably pretty comparable to a lot of people's homes or more. This was a very limited run. 55, 56, and 57. Right at 3,000 examples built throughout that time period. Just a super, super rare car. Hard to find them in this condition. Red oxide four pans on the vehicle throughout. All original panels, original California car. Brand new Coker, big white walls. Still has the original hubcaps. Paint, chrome, trim, bright work, etc. on the vehicle are exceptionally nice. Just an absolute stunning example. It is a Continental. A lot of people mistake it for a Lincoln Continental, which is incorrect. This was Continental, was a separate division from Ford at this time. These cars are handmade. They were to compete with the uh, Rolls Royce. And uh, rumor has it that uh, Continental was losing thousands of dollars on every sale of these vehicles. Extremely expensive to make. Pictures and video just do not do this car justice. The vents were not in the dash, they were in the ceiling. I believe this is one of the first automobiles to do that. And the jams are just absolutely gorgeous on this vehicle. We put the gas in, pulls over to the side, exhaust goes through the rear bumper. See all the chrome, 
This paint is extremely nice. Handles on the back of the seats. Just a drop dead gorgeous vehicle. 14,185 miles. Full gauges, just absolute gorgeous vehicle. We're gonna take this for a ride. Vehicle starts from the factory in neutral, like the Thunderbirds. Got a power windows work here. The wing window. Show them the back window there now, Drake, after that closes. All right, let's do this side. Does have a power seat. Functioning. Horn works, the lights work, the dash lights work, uh, wipers work. I know the uh, radio and the factory clock, I believe, are the only things that, that aren't working correctly. Three sixty eight V eight with the three speed automatic fifty six, it was two hundred and seventy five horsepower. Just quite a bit of horsepower, fifty six. You can see it's an excellent run and driving vehicle. Make sure you go to our website at www.westportautocenter.com. You'll see probably 20 plus highly detailed undercarriage, front end, rear end pictures of this uh, vehicle. Uh, seeing it in its red oxide primer color like it came from the factory. Uh, just again, a stunning example, super rare car, but it was brand new. this dark bronze color you always see these things in black or people paint them black but just a, a gorgeous color whoop well guess she didn't like that hill It's 
does have a uh, brand new rebuilt carburetor that was sent out to uh, Mark II Enterprises in uh, California. A brand new fuel pump um, that was rebuilt that was sent out to Mark II Enterprises as well in California. Both are on the vehicle right now. Uh, just absolutely, I don't know, it's hard, hard to describe how nice this car is. How well it drives. Take this to your car show. You do the bell of the ball. Speedometer works. All the gauges work. Um, again, the clock and the radio. High beams, low beams, wipers, headlights, and taillights, etc. All work on the vehicle as they should. Knight moves over to the side. Uh, like I said, the little knight moves over there, so. If you're in the market for a Mark II. This is one of the best examples you're going to find. Celebrity owned. Unbelievable quality. <laughs> 